In this video, we're going to look at Blood Angels Jump Pack Assault Squad. So, uh, assembled all these guys up first, and I used some of the bits from the um, the Death Company Blood Angel Marines, uh, mixed those in with regular Assault Squad. So I started off by spray painting everything a red, and I touched it all up with a blood red uh, from Games Workshop. So I just uh, tried to give a nice even coat there. So there you can see kind of a even coat of blood red. Uh, and then what I'm doing here, this is actually a mix of blaze orange and blood red, and I'm just going around all the edges, and then I'm going to do a bit of edge highlighting just with blaze orange. Okay, so that's just uh, all the red bits, just basic red highlights like that. And uh, for the helmets here on my assault marines, they get the Tau Sept Ogre for the, uh, the helmets. And there you can see how we're doing. So the, uh, the marines themselves are pretty simple. Um, I didn't spend a lot of time on the basic details, these are just uh, uh, going pretty quick and uh, pretty quick to get the ten guys on the field. So uh, working my way through there, uh, you can see I've uh, added some coffee grounds to the base uh, bases and uh, painted the outside edge Camry brown. Uh, now I'm going over all of the the dark bits here with uh, sharding granite mixed with a bit of chaos black, and that's just to to give these a base coat. So it's almost a black cl color. Uh, but it's a little bit of a gray and uh, that'll help me with my highlights. So anything that's going to be silver or black or gray. And uh, there's the base there, so a scorched brown kind of covering everything up and then a bit of a bestial brown dry brush. Okay, there you can see the bolt gun metal kind of going on these uh, the harnesses here and on some of the chain swords and bits on the bolter here. So just a really quick, quick uh, brush on there kind of avoiding some of the, the cracks, that way there's less uh, that I have to worry about later. Okay, and uh, so highlighting these up here with some Reaper Sun Yellow and Lemon Yellow. So that's just getting the, the yellows built up, nice nice uh, edge highlights on those. Okay, and uh, Adaptus Battle Gray um, for all of these uh, gray bits here. And then a little bit of uh, Codex Gray with edge highlighting. And then uh, this guy here has a bit of laurels on his head. That's going to be these uh, these green triad, this green triad here from uh, Reaper. And uh, some of that gray goes along here as well. And that's about it. Um, for the sergeant, I gave him a power fist. Just did uh, some regular highlights. So Teleron flesh uh, base, Ogren flesh wash, and then a bit of elf flesh uh, highlights. And uh, for any of the scrolls and stuff, that was just based uh, with scorched brown and then a uh, bleached bone sort of highlight. And then any script writing is done with uh, scorched brown as well. There's a couple of different pictures here. And a little bit of static grass on the bottom there just to break up the color. So I just used the leftover bits from the Blood Angels set. And uh, there you can see a close-up of the sergeant. There's uh, one of the shoulder pads. I didn't bother doing the gemstone in the middle. I figured uh, these guys are just uh, doing them pretty quick and dirty. Uh, any of these ropes here, uh, I just did those uh, with a, a vomit brown and bestial brown sort of a combination. And the eyes here, those are, that's that same green. You can see some of the writing on the edge there, um, and the the rope. So these guys painted up quite fast. Uh, the the red base coat covered most of the things, and then just a a watered down bl uh, Games Workshop blood red just helped uh, seal the deal. Uh, obviously, you can put more detail on there if you want. I also uh, did these. Uh, decals on the shoulder pads. Nothing too fancy there. But uh, pretty quick and effective way of getting these on the table.